So go ahead and mark the beginning of practice in whatever way is most meaningful to you. Um, for those of us who find ourselves sedentary quite a bit, that might be just a slight shift in your seat. It might be a stretch or two. You might allow your breath to be that welcome for you. What I mean by that is just a marked inhale and exhale. Perhaps it's slightly deeper or a bit more audible. But if it's not the ringing of the gong, what other ringing marks the beginning of your practice and calls in any seen or unseen supports? Maybe it's the symbolic ringing of your posture or your breath. Or it might be just a moment of intention. And here you are, gifting yourself this, this moment, this moment of practice. And so today we'll do our best not to complicate it any more than that. We'll just follow that similar prompt for another few moments. And if you're still in your mind, in the thinking mind, you might consider this the three naturals or a more direct translation of the three droppings, the, the dropping of the body and any holding on, the dropping of the breath, and any restriction, and the unfurling of the mind. So just allow that warm awareness to do a brief welcoming of your body. Let's see if there's any slight holding on that you are ready and willing to release. And if not, just simply willing and ready to acknowledge and welcome into its entirety. allowing the body to be to a place of connection. Or the communion with that larger expansiveness of being, in this case of being embodied.
And perhaps your breath has already followed suit. I find it, it's natural. Rhythm, depth, tone. Nothing extra to do here. But simply allow the breath to to be a doorway in. To pull you into oneness with. Well, and with a third natural, the mind allowing the same gentle invitation, a gentle awareness just as with the body and the breath. Dropping any agenda of the mind. You might even allow the body or the breath to ritualize that drop. Perhaps it's a slight leaning back or a noticing of that space between the inhale or the exhale that allows your mind to unfurl. And for these last few moments, playing in that space, 
resting wherever you are, however you are. Dropping any agenda, any instruction. And perhaps for many quickies rather than one longy, as a dear one of ours used to say. Just allowing yourself to be. Gently allowing yourself to come on back into contact with your body. Perhaps more specifically feeling the ground from under you. Perhaps it's the cushion from under your sit bone or the ground from under your feet. 
Allowing that grounding to bring you back into the physical space that you're in. Including the virtual space in front of you. And while continuing to acknowledge the continued practice among us for the rest of your day and hopefully the rest of your life. Taking a moment to mark the end of this formal practice in whatever way is more meaningful to you. You might take a minute to remind yourself of a prayer that is in your heart space right now. Perhaps you'll use your breath. Perhaps you have a gong nearby. Or if you wish, just take a moment to find a gentle smile in your heart, if not your mind in the face, to mark the preciousness of the opportunity to be here together. The unbelievable intricacy and interplay of conditions that have found us here right now. It can get pretty deep real quick and awe-inspiring, I hope, to consider mm. yeah, the truly precious conditions that have contributed to you being in whatever mark of health that you're in at this moment still breathing and all the clothes and beautiful backgrounds I see around you that some dear bodies and systems have contributed to you having around you and on you and then all the dear ones that you've come into contact with over your lifetime and before English is not my first language, you all. And yet here I am talking to you, right? Somebody had something to do with that. So I'll let you go as far and as deep as you want with, with that exploration, but I can't help but smile when I end my practice in that way. Thank you all. So if, uh, if it's okay with you, I'm gonna, well, I am going to stop the recording. Um.